My name is Paul Nyambe, and I'm the founder of Zamgot. Let's take a trip to Zambia, my beloved country in southern Africa. I was born and bred in a small village in Zambia, far from the nearest town. As a small boy, I walked 11 kilometers each way to get to school. From first grade until high school, with no shoes on my feet because I didn't have any. Sadly, nothing much has changed 25 years after my experience. Over half the population of Zambia lives in rural areas, with over 7 million being smallholder farmers. These farmers mostly grow maize to feed their families and at most have a small surplus to sell for income. According to the World Bank, Zambia's rural poverty rate is a crazily high 80%. These are poorest of the poor people that live on less than a dollar a day. In a world of entrepreneurs, a world of problem solvers like you and me, such levels of rural poverty should be a thing of the past. Meanwhile, most smallholder farmers in Zambia also raise goats, but not for milk, meat, or income. You see, goats have not been taken as a commercial product, but instead, they are merely raised as a symbol of prestige and productivity for the farmer and his village, and not sold for income. And sometimes, goats are slaughtered and eaten at festivals, especially in villages. On the other hand, there is a growing demand for goat meat, especially among urban populations, both within Zambia and in the neighboring countries. Goat is actually the second most popular meat in Zambia and around the region, second only to beef. One reason why beef is popular is that beef is a commercial product sold in any city market, while goat processing and distribution is still traditional and informal, or at least was until three years ago when I founded Zamgot, the first ever commercial scale aggregator, processor, and distributor of goat meat and other products in Zambia and around the region. To do this, I did not start raising goats. I started buying the already existing goats from smallholder farmers. The Zam goat model is simple. We buy goats from farmers. They earn income raising goats. We then process and distribute goat meat and other goat products such as goat leather, sold both on retail and wholesale, through our own retail outlets as well as supplying other customers and uh, retail stores. So far, operating without our own uh, transport and refrigeration facilities, we have over the last three years worked with more than 200 smallholder farmers and increasing their incomes by over 10%. We've processed and sold over 2,300 goats, earning the equivalent of $150,000 in revenue. So having proven our model now, we are seeking to scale up our business and to buy the needed equipment, transport, and code facilities, we are raising $100,000 in grants, loans, and equity. To begin with, we are currently running a Kiva campaign asking for people to lend us $10,000 so that we can get our business to the next level. You can visit that campaign and make your contribution as we fight rural poverty in Zambia. I therefore invite all of you beyond our Kiva campaign to join us in any way you can and to come visit Zamgot in Zambia to see firsthand how gods can feed the country and alleviate poverty. Thank you so much for coming to this event.